everybody and welcome back to some more planetary with janky nick hey, what is up welcome back to our horrible brown wasteland oh. look at this isaac this pig has a disease he is, oh he spent too much time in the wasteland man yeah he could just be a bit dirty you know could true rolled around in some mud maybe it's because they've been hit with the with the acid rain because this one's fine because he's smart right and didn't go outside the shelter of the uh the roof here but these ones did, Isaac, and they're, you know, all acidy. They've been infected. Yeah. With the acid rain. Yeah. It's quite possible, man. It is definitely quite possible. But the good news is, Nick, that our little grass platform has worked. We do now have mm. quite a few uh, mobs roaming around. Some pigs, some sheep, some cows, some uh, chickens, I assume, somewhere. But all is good, Nick. You know, it makes the wasteland just that little bit nicer. It does. You know, just like a little bit more homely. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Maybe these pigs have Corona Daddy, Isaac. Like, I mean, I hope not, Nick. You know? Then we're, then we're, we're screwed. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what we're calling the coronavirus? <laughs> yeah, now? because, right, I've been thinking about this. Right. That sounds, the, the official name for the coronavirus is Novel Coronavirus 2019, right? Right. You see that, you're going to think it's a bloody joke, right? Oh, it's that novel coronavirus. Well, I don't think they should call it Corona Daddy because then it's like, you know, the daddy, right? Of the whole you th virus <laughs> game. It's going to be like, you oh, think don't mess with Corona Daddy. You don't want hold that. Hold on. Hold on. You think the Corona Daddy <laughs> is a more intimidating name than novel coronavirus yeah, 2019? Of course. <laughs> I mean, uh, sure, Nick, you know, I mean, okay. Can we have a poll? I want a poll. <laughs> we can poll it. Yeah, we can poll it. <laughs> so last episode, Nick, we set up this little, uh, you know, monstrosity over here that is designed to produce obsidian. And when we did it, we did it in the knowledge, Nick, that much like everything else in our base right now, it is going to be slow. But it's going to get the job done, Nick. That's the motto. It's just the like us, to motto. be honest. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> Slow, but we get the job done eventually, Nick. And because it has been over a week since we recorded the last episode, oh. Nick, we now have a full chest of obsidian ready for us to use, Nick. And on top of that, over here in our hopping bonsai pot, Nick, we have got 35 and the pearls. That is so inside good. Inside all this chest. Mm, and all this fruit, Isaac. Look at this. I'm going to eat as some. As much chorus fruit as your heart could desire. Oh, it, oh, it teleported me. I forgot it did that. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. It was nice knowing you, Nick. Oh, there's a zombie here. Get out of here. Now, I was hoping, Nick, before we set off here, to make a, a set of elevators so that we could never ever ever have to use this staircase this stupid again staircase again it's, yeah this horrible spiral staircase now unfortunately i don't think we've got enough wall nick of all things we finally have enough ender pearls and it's wall that's holding us back oh my how much do you need you need 16 wall total so eight wall per elevator oh wow and you have been kind of you know trimming around over there isaac i've been crafting up the string nick i've been shearing down the sheep wow i've been doing all of the stuff nick and none of it None of it works. Now, thankfully, there is a way to make string using some of this uh, overworldly matter, but it is a little convoluted in that you have to craft overworldly matter with grass seeds, and the grass seeds are made by crafting a grass block, and the grass block is made with an overworldly matter, a dirt, and leaves of some description. So it's doable. It's just a bit of a a bit of a hassle, Nick. But I will I will make it work. Never fear. Could you, Nick, stand on the elevator in the center of the room? Yes. Am what I is your up? Y level? Oh, my Y level. It's 46. Um, and, ooh, okay. You're at negative 1519 and then Z206. That's it, yeah. And you're at 49? 46. 46. Right. Which means this is 21 blocks up. I think these can only go like 15 or 16 blocks. Ah, so we're going to have to double jump, Isaac. I think we're, we're going to have to put to double an extra one in the middle. Double it up, Nick. Yeah, yeah double, double it right trouble. up. Oh no, it's just like a double cheeseburger, Isaac. Exactly. Do you ever, do you ever double up anything like food-wise when you order stuff? I'm not a doubler because I always see it, and like it's, Burger King is notorious for this. They're always like, make it an extra large. You make it an extra large. Oh, make it a double it up. Make it, make it a super big boy, right? And I'm just like, come on, man. I just want my regular ass meal. And they're like, no, you got to double it up, maybe. And then I'm like, no, I don't want to. Because they're like, double it up for an extra six pounds. I'm like, no, please. But like, given the option between a cheeseburger and a double cheeseburger, what are you taking? So I'll always take the single, right? Because really? then it's just too much meat. And then it's like, it's like, you know, everything, like, like a once great big purple man said, Isaac, 
everything in balance or something like that, right? So yeah, you, <laughs> I was thinking of Barney the Dinosaur <laughs> when you said a big great purple <laughs> man. <laughs> Barney, Barney the Dinosaur. He was a bear. You, you bore, you bad man. You're not a moron, Isaac, but you are a madman. Oh, my. Uh, <laughs> uh, like Barney the Bear once said before he tried to sw- end half of the universe. <laughs> Can you imagine if that was Barney the Bear just in another Barney's, costume? No, 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 no. Barney's a dinosaur, man. Barney's... Maybe he's a dinosaur. He's a dinosaur, man. Is he a dinosaur? I'm not making this up. He's no, a purple maybe dinosaur. You're right. Maybe you're right. He's a maybe I'm bear. thinking of Barnaby Bear. I'm thinking of Winnie the Pooh is what you're thinking of. <laughs> oh, he is a dinosaur. I apologize. Yeah. Come, look Come on, look at him on Google. He does look weird, doesn't he? <laughs> Yeah, he's a little, uh, a little out there. Isn't that like... where Taylor Swift came from? I swear she was on Barney. <laughs> she came from Barney. I'm pretty sure she was one of the kids on Barney. No. She wasn't in the Barney suit, although that would have been amazing. <laughs> Isn't that where Taylor Swift I'm came from? I'm pretty sure that's where Taylor Swift came from. I'm not even going to lie. Well, I mean, we'll have to, we'll have to get the fact checkers in on that one, Nick. <laughs> yeah, comments. Can you tell us if, uh, if that's where Taylor Swift came from? These backpacks are actually garbage, Isaac. They've only got two rows of slots. Like that's even worse than our inventory. I mean, that's not. That's it's still extra though, right? Like it's still. It's still extra. It's not. It's not taking away inventory space. That would have been extra <laughs> that bad. Would, that would be a very bad backpack. <laughs> that would be yeah. an awful backpack. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you would insert the backpack into your own body or something like that. Like whoa. There we go. Like I made a quick little upgrade to our uh, our furnace here. Oh wow! Look at you freaking splashing the cash. Yeah, you, you know what, Nick? You, you cash splasher. I'm gonna splash even more cash, Nick. We have splash got it. <laughs> splash it. We have got one, two, three, four, almost five stacks of gold, Nick. And I'm oh, gonna do sell we? Oh, where is it? All um, it's in my inventory, Nick. Oh, I need. Is. I need a bit for these uh, backpacks. Oh. I don't need that much. I need like ah. Uh, I can't sell all of them to to buy a minigun. There you go. That's, Thanks, well, you don't, need, you don't need two stacks, man. Let's be real. I just you need can have, like, you can have 58. There you go. Yeah, that'll do. Thanks, okay, man. I'm going to sell. Oh, Nick, I have got $10,000 oh, in wow. the no, shop. That is how you make some money Here in this market. Here we go. Nick. 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 Oh, oh there it is. This. <laughs> that is unreal. Does it spin for you? It does. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I see it spinning at the front. That is does it amazing. not spin for you? It's not spinning for me, but I have a feeling that might oh. just be animations turned off. Here you off. go. I'll give you, uh, I'll give you this thing. See if you uh, see it spinning when you hold it. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that. Oh God, careful, Nick. Those bullets are a dollar a piece. <laughs> oh, uh, well, <laughs> if Mr. Richman over here is it can afford them, <laughs> selling all of our gold on the market. Yeah, there we go. Oh nice. man, I like it. All right. Now, before we head out, Nick, one tip that was given to me by the comment section is that we can use the mechanism cardboard boxes to greatly ease our dungeon clearing experience. Because what you can do is you can right click a cardboard box onto any mob spawner and that will basically neutralize that mob spawner. It'll just stop spawning mobs as if the mob spawner has been broken. And then if we want, we can even go as far as to bring those mob spawners back inside of the cardboard box for use in our base. Also, Nick, again, just a a, a massive amount of information is being thrown at me by the YouTube comments, Nick. If you open up your inventory Mm -hmm. and you click on the top middle slot, there are the bullet slots. Yes. Ah, so I can put them, I guess, somewhere here. You can put your bullets in the bottom right of the slots. But Nick, more importantly, the top three slots that look like food, you can put your food in there and your body will auto-feed you when you need food. Oh, that's amazing. I know, right? And if you get like a little healing product as well, you can put it in that little health slot and it'll heal you up when uh, when needed as well, Nick. I can't put my bullets in these bullet slots. Really? Yeah, they they ain't fitting, man. I can put my food in the food slot. Right. But not the other way around. It might be a different type of bullet, like maybe it's a different mod. You know, right, mods, bullets. See. The food thing is really good, though. It is extraordinarily good, Nick. I think it even means that you could go and grab some of those, like, energy drinks as oh, well, even though you have the rations. Wow, yeah, I do have some like energy drinks. Like, over here, we've got yeah. speedy energy drink, stealthy energy drink, you know, some tea. Yeah, super energy drink. Oh, put All some kinds tea of stuff. in that. Like, whack some tea in that slot. 
Porto fed some tea. Oh, you can put the energy drinks in there, yeah. Nice. Oh. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Do we have wood? We do. We have a lot of it. So if we pulverize the wood, every single one plank or log of wood turns into eight sawdust stick and eight sawdust can make two cardboard boxes and so we will have a ridiculously large number of cardboard boxes in no time at which point nick we're gonna go to the cyber lab we're going to head down hopefully with a lot of torches make sure you've got like a stack of those mm -hmm. uh, on you Let as well find some so we've got any i think okay, there's, make there's a some. stack in here oh, nick, stack in there okay. as well I'll put that in my uh, defense slot, ready to, to slack him, slack him, whack him down. <laughs> ready to slack him down. Ready to slack him like usual. <laughs> <laughs> but we're going we're gonna to get the torches, Nick. We're going to light it up. We're going to box up all of the spawners to stop them spawning. We can kill any loose mobs that are walking around, Nick. And then from there, we can find the schematic and we can come back. Amazing. Bish, bash, bosh. Oh, you know, I love it. Jobs are good. All right, Nick. The only thing that we really need to get out of this expedition, Nick, is the gosh darn schematic. Right, okay. Because, boy, oh boy, have we failed to get it thus I know, far, terrible. It's all we, we need. I've got my super energy drink in hand ready to consume so that I don't get absolutely mauled. Okay, I've neutralized the first uh, card, the first spawn, Nick. Okay, we now have nice. a fragile cardboard box uh, down. And so I'm just going to continue to... I've located a bat and I'm not ready to... I'm ready to fire. <laughs> gosh dang it, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out here neutralizing spawners and Nick's shooting his bullets at bats. <laughs> I wasn't actually. I was ready, though. Looks like there's a lot of zombies in this one. Here we mm. go. Ooh, I'm wow, not going to check yeah. any chests, really, until, like, you know, all of these spawners are neutralized. Right, Oops, yeah, that makes sense. You don't want to be, you know, being... So is this, like, a, a non-Android one, then? Yeah, because, so the whole right. point is that there are five... There are different dungeons, and we have to go into one of each different dungeon. I see. I think there right. are five different kinds, and we've got to go into each one. This one is a cyber lab, as opposed to an android lab. Right. I see. There's also a space lab. I think there's like a, a scientist lab. There's a few Ooh. different kinds of, uh, of underground lab, and we have to attend each one individually. And uh, and acquire the, acquire the goods. The goods, yes. Oh, I found a, a big old room over here, Nick. You know what, freaking... Get the minigun out. Oh, he's going for it. I can hear it. Okay, I definitely should have got uh, more bullets. Right. Because this thing is he's, not I can hear powerful. it. You're, um, you're going <laughs> quite fast there. It's also not as strong as I was hoping. Right, I see. I think it, yeah, it's four damage per, um... Right. Per boule. Per, per boule. boule. Uh, I should also be torching. I'm not torching as, as yeah, liberally as I should be that. here. Ooh, there's a lot of, uh, mobs around these ends. But, uh, right. is there any... Oh, God, this guy's got, like, a, a buff. I can't hit him. Is there any food that you do like to double up, Nick? Are you a double on, uh... Um, like, maybe on guacamole well, the or something? Issue, oh, yeah. Like, maybe, like, something like sour cream, Isaac. Or, Ooh. like, you know, something like that. Ooh. Like, I really do... I am a a fan of the old, like, sauce. Like, double up on ketchup. Like, double up on, you know, barbecue sauce. Tell you what I, um... Would love to double up on, Isaac little little release recently uh i don't know if you've seen this but pizza hut oh god uh, don't even uh, don't here, yeah even here we here we go i am intrigued to know your thoughts on this nick uh, so for those on. unaware the pizza hut corporation a subsidiary of yum brands llc yes. has uh teamed up with kentucky fried chicken also a subsidiary of yum brands llc to produce a new pizza here in the UK, Nick. And yes. I'm not going to lie. It looks like an absolute abomination. Oh, it looks awful. But it holy looks... crap. Have oh, you tried it? I want to. Right? Okay. But it's sold out. <laughs> it has. It's sold out everywhere. So, again, for those who don't know, the idea here is they made a, a KFC pizza. And the what it is, there's a standard Pizza Hut base, like mm -hmm. dough. Topped lusciously, lusciously with thick KFC gravy, which as of in, in place of like a tomato base, which is horrendous. And then on top of that, they have cheese, KFC's own 
uh, like chicken nuggets, chicken bites, mm-hmm. popcorn, popcorn chicken, chicken. <laughs> yeah, and sweet corn. And I mean, like I say, it sounds. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm not gonna die. You got I'm any potions, Isaac? I'm dead. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I died. No! I did so well last time, Nick. I managed to not die, and this time I have. Oh, I have we've swapped roles. It. I've been okay so far. So Pizza Hut's come out with a KFC pizza with gravy, popcorn, chicken, and sweet corn on it, and it looks awful. But you freaking bet I want to try it because it sounds amazing. It's one of those things, Nick, where it might just be disgusting enough to be delicious. Great, right? Yeah. It might just be the exact right amount. It's like, you know, that we talked before, Nick, about the Uncanny Valley on this uh, on exactly. this show. The Uncanny Valley is where as you get more lifelike, things become more creepy until you hit a point where they look so lifelike that they stop looking creepy. Right. And I feel like that's how it is with food. As you get more disgusting... It gets kind of, you know, more and more disgusting, but there's a point where it gets so disgusting that it's actually good, right? Exactly, exactly. It's like it's like blue cheese, right? Yeah. You know, people like it because it's so disgusting. It's moldy exactly. cheese. Exactly, it's moldy ass, blue but ass people love it. cheese. And I've have you ever tried blue cheese? I have, yes. It's weird, but it's kind of like so weird that you're like, Ooh, I feel like a posh person now. I feel like I'm eating caviar. <laughs> so you like it almost out of principle. I see. Okay. Okay. We might have different uh, <laughs> different <laughs> no? thoughts for after eating blue cheese, but I'll take it, man. I'll take it. Yeah, like I um, eat it and it tastes oh, like gosh. absolute, like pure ass, right? And right. I'm like, God, this is blue cheese. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> no? <laughs> Just me? Have you, uh, have you ever tried caviar, Nick? Um, I've tried it once or twice. It's very interesting because it's not, it's it's just salty taste wise. Right. But it's the texture that's really weird because you like chew into it a bit and you feel a bit of firmness and then suddenly it pops. Right. And you all this like juiciness and it's like, ooh. Um, it's interesting. It's nice. I'd have it again if it wasn't like a billion pounds per yeah. kilo. Um, I'm not going to lie. It sounds, I've not tried it. Uh, your description does not make it sound more advertising. <laughs> but, it's uh, like tapioca, I'm but natural, kind of. I don't think I've ever had tapioca. You've never had tapioca? You know? He's going to no. get some bubble tea, Isaac. I feel like we live very different lives, Nick. I'm out here eating uh, bread. You're out and... here eating chicken, popcorn <laughs> chicken on pizza, and what you really need is a bit of tapioca. That's, the, like... that's the real thing, right? It's uh, The popcorn chicken... If it was just a popcorn chicken pizza, I'd be like, oh, sure. It's a fried chicken pizza. Delicious. However, oh, it's the gravy, right? It's the inclusion of thick gravy yeah, as a, as a exactly. substitute for, for sauce. Yeah, it's a weird one. I think there is a, a debate to be had here as to what defines a pizza. Sure. I know there are people out there who will argue that if a pizza does not have a tomato base, then it's not a pizza. Yeah, which is weird because if you actually go to Italy, some pizzas don't have tomato base. Like it's really? just like yeah, it's like alternative. Are they, are they putting? Uh, oh god, are they putting, over here, putting gravy on? Are they putting Isaac? gravy down there? Yeah, <laughs> and popcorn chicken. Hold on a second. <laughs> <laughs> this is not an original idea. <laughs> That's the uh, standard. Uh, the standard Italian pizza is actually dish. what what uh, Pizza Hut have done is actually you know gone extra authentic. But yeah, I'm definitely going to try that when when it comes back into stock. Out of I mean, people must be buying it. They sold out in one day. Yeah, like it was like it it sold out quick. Um, so I mean, people are loving it. People man. want Let it. Let us know in the comment section. Would you eat a pizza that has gravy on it as, as the a, base? its only sauce? Because <laughs> like uh, yeah. You know Jeez. what it needs, Isaac, to complete my um, spec. It just needs a load of ketchup, and then we're uh, <laughs> and then we're, uh, we're we're in heaven. I need to know, uh. like, are you one of these monsters who will dunk their pizza in ketchup? Um, I have done it in the past. You, but monster. only, <gasps> only. <gasps> oh, have you got I it? I found the schematic. Oh, he's got it. But I mean, I only found it because the creeper blew up the chest it was in. Oh, wow, that is risky. <laughs> oh, my God. That's probably exactly what happened last time. Just it went with the explosion. Oh, I see I that. Was oh, so amazing. Worried. Like, I saw the... Uh, oh, I need to eat food as well. Like, I'm, Yeah, careful. I forgot you to don't want my... to die at the last hurdle. Yeah, I forgot to put my... I'm also an out of torches, Nick. So ah. if you could make your way uh, to... The bagging area, that would be appreciated. To the bagging area. Okay, I'm, uh, let me see. Where are you? Oh, you are Basically, there. If you're I'm making my me. way. 
Let me get rid of this uh, spawner here. Whoo! Okay. There's also a... Okay, so there's a, an enchanted diamond sword, which I will take. It has soulbound 7, vorpal 6, and sharpness 6. I'll take that. Uh, there's also a ton of... This, 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 this chest that had the goods in it has got, like, a lot of goods in it, man. Right. Oh, I'm trying to make my way towards you, but there's no, like, passage to that area. Let's see. Yeah. Like, I've got, like, a full set of enchanted diamond armor here, Nick. From this one oh my chest. God. Also, eight wither skeleton skulls. Oh, I see you. Thank you. Oh, wow. That is useful, actually. I know, right? Yeah. There we go. Oh, my God. Yeah, this, uh, this is, I need some torches over here, here basically. I think I'm about to run out, too, actually. Okay, let me just... Uh... Hello. Oh, yeah. Look at this. What is yeah, look, there's, there's some more diamond stuff here if you need diamond armor. Amazing. I have, um, oh, yes, I've got some more, actually. Here we go. I don't know if it's, oh, there's 54 torches in here. Oh, nice. Madman. I was going to say, I don't know if it's because we've, uh, I've not been checking chests, but, oh, Nick, this, uh, I have re received a new diamond sword, and it is, is it, powerful. Is it a good boy? Very it's nice. a good boy. It's a good boy. Oh. Indeed. All we've right. done it. We've got we've it. We've done it. Oh. oh. I guess we've kind of come here to do what we wanted to then, Isaac. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I do also want to uh, take a few of these the spawners. spawners home. Yeah. Yeah. So we should definitely do that. Uh, let me use my backpack for the first time today. I'll dump all this uh, oh, yeah, stuff in God, here. Yeah. <laughs> the thing is that you actually forget. Brings backpack, doesn't use backpack. <laughs> exactly. Oops. <laughs> I've been like dumping stuff on the floor. Like, <clears throat> tell you what though, Isaac, see what I do have. Look at this. What's that? Where are you at? Uh, oh, just here. I've got a, uh, look at this, a, tren <laughs> a trench coat. <laughs> that robe. Oh, oh my, look at That's <laughs> very, uh, very swanky. Nick. Unreal. Okay, I'm, I'm picking up these, uh, these monster spawners. So the idea is that we can use these just like as monster spawners. You know, we can use them for yeah. more lessons. We could use them for pink slime. We could use them just for getting like, you know, rotten flesh or gunpowder or anything like that. Like, we can just use these for basically whatever mm. we like going forward here, Nick, which is very nice indeed. Very, very nice. Um, I do see some more some androids, androids over here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, like over oh, wow. in this Make direction. Some sounds. Yeah. Right. Oh, it looks like they're like behind a wall. Yeah, they are kind of like imprisoned in a, in a in, their own, in their own walls. I mean, you know what, Isaac? Um, I wouldn't... They can, we're good they with, can stay we're there. Leave those guys in, they their own, stay there. in their own place. They can be... Yeah. All right. They can be pets to their own... They can be slaves to the room, Isaac. So the final question here, Nick, is I have another lab marked, a space lab. Ooh. Do you are we going quickly, to two in two? Yeah. Do you want to bounce home real quick? Drop, drop this drop stuff, our stuff off. off. Yeah. And then and uh, go, and the go in one. for, a, for a, a duo. Ooh, so this time I think we're looking for a, a research paper. If you press your quest key, you'll see that right now we're just in the top level, right? The top line in the second quest chapter. Oh, yes. Okay, right. I see. The android is the second to last one. Yeah, because we've ticked the egg bit, haven't we? Yes. Yeah. I think right now we're going for the middle one. So we're not looking for a schematic. We're looking for a research paper. Right, I see. Mars research paper. Okay. I believe so. That's if I've marked this right, but I'm pretty sure this is a space lab. Okay. You can tell based on the block that the building is made out of on the surface. Right. So we should hopefully be in for a, for a research paper here, Nick. Mm. Ideally. Oh, we're here to get that, you know, MLA style, you know, well-referenced piece of research material. Exactly. Oh. Here we go. We'll, be, uh, we'll both be tenured professors after this, Nick. We'll be mm, MLA, well APA, GSA, oh. MI, MIA, MI5, GMO, HMO, HMO, HNO3, yeah. <laughs> O2. <laughs> <laughs> Here right. we go. Oh it's, very, oh, it's very dark. It is You've already very been, dark. Oh, my gosh. Hello. Androids are Androids. about. Androids. Are you the one shooting? I'm shooting. Okay. Just for... For reference. Just for reference, yes. That's Just the sound so I know of who's, me going... who's shooting. <laughs> I don't like the unevenness of the floor. Right? No, it's very... It's the air. You have to kind of do a bit of jumping, a bit of, you know... It's what? Oh, they're at Enderman. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've got to stop. Oh, no. Oh no! I need to reload my I've gun. I've got to stop with the creepers, man. I keep blowing creepers up. Yeah, and it's such a high very chance risky. That I just it's extremely everything. risky. Oh man! Oh no! I've, I've... 
Locked myself down. I never know what's more important here, torching up the area or getting the spawners cardboarded. Yeah, I think it's probably the spawners, because... That's what I went with, but I find that if you, uh, if you oh, run in... Oh, oh hello, 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 my friend. No. I'm here, Nick. Never fear. I'm here to help you with I'm this. having a, I'm having a super range drink. I think I'm going to die. I'm going to die. No, no, no. I got, I'm you, good. I got you. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, I I'm killed him. Don't you worry. He's dead. Just about managed to take a potion. The mean man's not going to hurt you anymore, <laughs> Nick. Don't you worry. The mean man's not going to hurt me anymore, please. <laughs> I think you shot me. Well, I think I did shoot you once that <laughs> accident. Oh, God. There are so many creepers here. I think this is deliberate just to really mess with us. To make this one like the hardest. Yeah. Oh, this giant zombie. Oh man. That's quite possibly true. Given that this book. is like the only one that's not, you know, a, a schematic. Right. Yeah. Maybe exactly. this one's supposed to be harder. They're trying to, you know, guard that research, Isaac. Maybe that contains the uh seven thirteen or seven secret herbs and spices, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's, what, that's actually what this really is. I think, I think it's eleven for one. Ele <laughs> 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 I thought it was too little, too many. Yeah, maybe we're trying to find the KFC secret recipe, Isaac. This is what this is. news though nick as per as always is, is that, that we now got have one at least we got one yeah <laughs> and we also have a strategy for getting yes. more right like getting multiple of these now really shouldn't be too bad we just gotta go further afield find more dungeons to do this again and uh, hopefully not blow up as much going yes. forward <laughs> which is which is um Easier said than done, but very the much so. stupid amount of creepers. Crazy. Yeah. I'm wondering if there's like a, a creeper. I, I'm, I was wondering if there's like an item or like a buff like that makes us like invisible to creepers or, or something like that. Yeah. Well, you know what? There is an energy drink that makes you invisible, but I don't know how effective it is against mobs. This room is definitely a slime chunk, which is good. Nice. But uh, we could, I mean, if we wanted to cheese it. We could claim the chunks of the dungeon. Right, so that they don't blow. So that mob they griefing don't is off. Yeah. yeah. Uh, it seems a bit cheesy though, Nick. But, you know, we'll see how it goes. We'll, we'll yeah. do a few more. If we do like three more and don't get any schematics. <laughs> and from may... explosions, then maybe we will turn it off. <laughs> just to save ourselves from going mad. <laughs> exactly, exactly. But for now, Nick, I think that's a good place to wrap up for today. As always, if you enjoyed the video, that mask you've got on, man, is what in the world? Have you f 5 this? <laughs> I look, like I've, I look like I've stolen it and I'm not telling you about it. <laughs> I've actually robbed the schematic oh and the back while we've, been, while we've been here. Oh, hello. Uh, look at this. I now amazing. also have a rub, Nick. Oh, look at you, look at you Isaac. Let me there put my uh, my trench coat on to uh, to go with it. I'm going to have to drop something. In. Oh, yeah. Mine is also a trench coat from is Cyberware. Trench coat? Oh, yeah. good stuff. Right, what am I dropping? What am I getting rid of? I'm getting rid of this rotten flesh. Here we go. Oh, beautiful. Here we go. Uh, oh, that, that iron chest plate is, is 
I was got curse of binding eyes. Can't ah. take it off. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just gonna have to stick like this. Oh. Well, as always, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video and you want to see more planetary in the future, go ahead and hit that like button. It really does help out a lot. Leave a comment down below, subscribe if you're new here to get notified as soon as new videos go out. As always, thank you for watching. I will see you guys next, next time. time. Goodbye. Goodbye.